Well, so often we have guests come on the show to catch us up on current trends and topics, but most of the time they are knowledgeable adults. Well, today's segment, it's a little different because Allie Graham is a very knowledgeable 11-year-old from Mesa, Arizona, and she is joining us this morning to show us some neat ways that we can decorate our fingernails. Welcome to Sonoran Living, Allie. Hi, thank you. This is where you talk. <laughs> Sorry. It's okay. I know you're nervous. Okay, so I met Allie um, a couple of actually a couple of years ago and she's always doing really cool things with her nails so we invited you on the show today and we're gonna be talking about um, marbling stamping and then the magnetic polish mm -hmm. okay so let's start with uh, with the marbling okay um, do you want to see an example yeah go ahead and show me those oh. and tell me what we're gonna be doing here. Um, right here like the, these ones are marbling uh -huh. um, with the designs and all you do is you take is this some, this polish. is something that we could do at home Mm -hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. Okay. It's pretty simple. All you're going to need is nail polish, a cup of room, pe room temperature filtered water, and um, something sharp to do the design. With. Okay. Well, let's get started. You have four nail polishes mm -hmm. here that you got at like Walgreens or something? Um, CBS. CBS. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. So, how does it work? All you do is these are from Milan, and um, all you're going to do is you're just going to take the nail polish and drop it in. Okay. And it makes a ring. And then if you put the next color in, it'll so spread. So it's almost like a like a tie dye, almost, right? Mm -hmm. Sort of. And um, after you do your couple rings, and you I'm could just, just keep going, like it's mm -hmm. endless. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to do one more set. Okay. And um, after we do this last set, what you're going to do? Gosh, that would just be a fun is, art project for the kids. Mm-hmm. <laughs> that looks fun. And then um, I'm just going to finish up and take the orange stick. Okay. And what you're going to do, you're just going to draw however you want. And it doesn't look like it's moving too much. I mean, it moves exactly where you want it to move. Mm-hmm. And then you just dot out the center so there's not too much polish. Okay. So now I'm and really curious how we're going to get it on our fingernail. You take Okay. So this. The, you're using fake nails. Mm -hmm. And if we were using fake nails... You'd have to use tape to tape up your finger here and here. Mm -hmm. And so you would dip in this way. Okay. So I'm just going to use the fake nail. And okay. then you, you, I'm going to dip in sideways. So you dip in. And then you shake it so the bubbles come off. And then I'm just going to take the um, thing we used to design and I'm going to blow. And what does that do? It dries the polish so it's easier to clean up. And then you just clean up. It's amazing that, that it's the liquid and it just sort of disappears. And, mm -hmm. and I can't believe that this is going to be nice and hard. Let me see the nail. I'm and then you see slowly it. pull it out. Oops. Oh, that's okay, honey. Okay, let me see the nail. Ah. I'm trying to. It's okay. Live hold television it up. here. Look at that. And we could do this on our real nails, too. Mm -hmm. And you said the key to this is just to go ahead and put. Um, some Vaseline or some tape. Mm -hmm. Okay. Like I have this tape here that all you would do, you'd put a thick strip right here. Okay. And then you would do another strip here. Okay. And then. All right. Let's um let's talk about the magnetic, and I'll okay. go ahead and put the lids on these nail polishes. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So what is the magnetic stuff, and where do we get that? Um, I'm just gonna move this out of the way. Okay. Um, right here I have these nail polishes, and I got these at um. So Sephora. Sephora, yes. yeah. Sorry. It's okay. And, we know um, where Sephora is. Yeah. And what you do is... Um, Let's go ahead and show what some of these look okay. like. There are these um, polishes that have a, a magnet on the top. Mm -hmm. And what you do is you just um, take your nail... Here. So would you paint the nail for, first? So we'd paint you it take, like maybe this yeah, color? Yeah. And you have to do one thin coat. Okay. And then after um, that dries completely, you have to take... Um, I need to open this. That's okay. Do you want me to open it? Yes, please. We might have to have our, our... There we go. I got it. Okay. okay thank you. You're welcome. And, um, and there's all different colors of this. Mm -hmm. there, well, at Sephora, there's only three different colors, but you can go to Justice or... Um, I've only found a couple at Justice that have the different colors. So you do the thin coat, and then do you go back on and put a nice... another coat yeah, on it? a thick coat, and then you take your magnet, Uh huh. and then you just go down the nail. And it's pulling it up and making yeah. really cool things. And then, um, Look at that. There's the design. That is really neat. Now, tell me, Allie, how you find your, your inspiration. I mean, um, you're 11. How do you know all this stuff? I go to YouTube, mm -hmm. and um, I type in nail art designs, and um, it just shows you very different ways to do your nails. Like, if you want to use nail polish or the stamping or the water marble or the magnetic, 
So it just shows you different ways you and can do it. And what advice do you give? Because kids, I mean, you don't get as frustrated, I don't think, mm -hmm. as adults. So I'm mm -hmm. sure if I tried to do this, I would be really frustrated. What <laughs> advice do you give to all of us? Both? Just practice, 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 and don't get frustrated. Okay. Because if you get frustrated, then you'll like end up going Giving up, insane. right? Yes. Okay. You know what, Liz, can you show me how to do this one? This is called what? Stamping? Stamping, yeah. Okay. Um, it looks complicated. I'm just saying. I'm going to take the white right here because mm -hmm. it's the easiest one. Okay. And if you want to pick a design. Pick a design? Yeah. Um, I want to pick, um, I want to pick, I want to pick that flower right there. Okay. So I'm just going to grab And this. where do you get this? Is this the one um, that you got on an infomercial or? Um, yeah. My mom and I were watching TV and um, I saw this on an infomercial. And you and, had to have it because had to it have has it, yeah. to do with nails. Yeah. The um, one that I really want is very expensive. Like it can, they can go from like ten dollars around this one to forty four hundred. Four hundred? Four hundred forty. Well, they right. can go Maybe really high. Maybe if you're really good. Yeah. Okay. Um, all you're going to need is a color of your choice and it doesn't really matter what kind of nail polish but people say you have to spend twenty bucks on one nail polish but you don't. All you need to do is um, paint over so you're just painting over the design. You take your scraper. Okay. You scrape it. Do you need this anymore? No. Nope. Okay. And um, you take the stamper. Okay. You stamp on, and then there. Can it, we put it on? Oh well, want. let's put it on the white. It'll yeah. be easier to see. And then you just transfer it over. Look at that. And there's all different designs. Mm -hmm. And then would you just put a, a clear nail polish or something yeah, over it? Yeah, because it like it becomes matte when you um, don't put a clear. So okay. I would just take a regular clear nail polish and paint over it. Well, Allie, you are awesome. Thank you so much. Allie has been doing nails since she was two, I understand. And uh, actually, this was a project you did in school. Mm -hmm. You had to make a pyramid that represented yourself. Yeah. And it's a little nail salon. Um, what grade did you get on it? An A+. Plus. Good job. <laughs> Good job. High five. All right. Well, uh, we are going to have uh, all of this information. If you would like to try uh, some of these uh, fun nail techniques at your home or yeah, you can't have Allie do it. Her mom won't let you. But we will have the information on our website at sonoranliving.com. Thank you, Allie. Thank you.